Steelers Nation, how's everyone doing? You know the team is constantly striving to improve, and it's no different on the offensive line. Today, we've got some big news about Broderick Jones. Before we dive in, make sure to hit that like button, and if you haven't already, subscribe so you never miss an update. Now, let's talk about Sunday's game. Broderick Jones, our 2023 first-round pick, had a rough time, three penalties in just six plays. After that, it seemed like Jones was headed for a long stretch on the bench. But guess what? That time on the sidelines will be much shorter than expected. With starting right tackle Troy Fatanu going down with an injury in practice this week, Jones is getting another shot at redemption. Fatanu was a late addition to the injury report and is now on injured reserve, which means he'll miss at least the next four games. That puts Jones back into the starting lineup, this time as right tackle, and he'll have to step up in a big way. The Steelers have a tough road ahead, starting with a home opener against the Los Angeles Chargers, followed by games against the Indianapolis Colts, Dallas Cowboys, and Las Vegas Raiders. It's going to be fascinating to see how Jones performs, especially since both he and Fatanu were first-round picks in back-to-back -back drafts, Jones in 2023 and Fatanu in 2024. Originally, the plan was for Fatanu to lock down the right tackle spot while Jones would take over at left tackle, pushing veteran Dan Moore Jr. to the bench. But that didn't quite go as expected. Fatanu quickly secured the starting job, while Jones struggled throughout training camp, preseason, and in his limited regular season snaps. But now, with Fatanu sidelined, Jones has the opportunity to rewrite the narrative and prove he's ready to take on a bigger role. The offensive line is looking young and inexperienced, with Jones at right tackle, rookie Zach Frazier at center, and backup Spencer Anderson filling in at left guard for the injured Isaac Sumolo. Sumolo, our best offensive lineman, still hasn't played this season. Steelers Nation, I want to hear from you, do you think Jones will rise to the occasion? Will our young O-line hold up under pressure? Drop your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more updates. We've got a lot to talk about this season.